MTD CNC, bringing you the latest engineering news, reviews, events, and special offers via video media. So Steve, this is the light CMM machine. This is the entry level? Well, this is the, uh, the entry level lights machine that we do. Um, you can appreciate that a lot of customers come to lights mainly for accuracy. Um, typically, our, our most accurate Infinity CMM, which is the lights Infinity, has got a first term accuracy of 0.3 of a micron. So there's lots of CMM machines in the market, Steve. What makes the lights a little bit different? Well, the nice thing about lights is that people see the lights brand as being um, the synonymous for accuracy. You know, the most accurate CMM is the Lights Infinity, and it's got a first term accuracy of 0.3 of a micron. So when people are really chasing the tolerances, so you can appreciate on complex gear measurements or even blade measurements, there's, there's some tolerances that you know they're chasing 20 microns. So if you want first term accuracy below uh, a micron, you know yeah. you're typically chasing uh, nanometers. Um, and lights themselves, they, they've got very good. Um, standards of quality, so the encoders that we use and the scales and even down to the probe sensors that we use, you know, we're at, this is where the technology is, is inside here. Effectively inside the CMM itself, which you can appreciate is XYZ coordinate system, we've also got an XYZ coordinate system in our probe heads as well. So that, that, that's where we get the, the, the tenths of microns accuracy out of the system. Is that unusual in a CMM machine? To have it, it pretty much is unusual, yeah. I mean, you generally have a lot more of indexing heads on CMMs for, for again, measuring into complex shapes. Um, the problem with that is, is that you're inducing more uncertainty in measurements. So with a lights range of machines, that's where we're chasing the microns. So it's the real Rolls-Royce end of... Absolutely, absolutely. And this is one of our entry-level uh, lights reference machines, so you can appreciate that uh, we're trying to make a system that's still got the accuracy, but more of an affordable price. Right, OK. And this is a typical example of the type of part you're doing here, isn't it? Absolutely, yeah. yeah. You can appreciate that, uh, obviously, we've only got it set up quite, uh, quite simply here in the vice, but we can have uh, rotary tables. Um, and the th other thing with the lights machines is that you can actually have a, a fourth axis. So you can have a rotary table that's rotating, and you're measuring as it's rotating at the same time. So again, that's pretty unique to, to this range of machines. Wow, and when we say entry level, is, is that because you're talking about the capacity? No, it's no, no, it's, it, yeah, it's right. No, entry level in terms of price. Um, obviously, the, the lights infinity machines, you know, they can significantly be uh, a, a good investment for you. Yeah. Okay, and do you carry these machines here in stock at Hexagon, or how, how does that Most work? machines are typically made to order. Um, we've got so many different ranges of sizes, you know, the virtually different configurations of heads and things like that, so it's, it's more of a turnkey thing, but obviously this is our showroom, so we've got some examples in here to show customers. Yeah, I would imagine it's not the sort of machine that you'd just come and buy, you, you, you'll have an application, you'll be driven by yeah. a project, and that's how this works. Absolutely, uh, yeah. Uh, the key thing for us first is to understand exactly what the customer's needs are. Let's drill down, let's understand the tolerances, the accuracy requirements, and then basically we'll build the machine around that configuration. It certainly looks like a, a fairly prestige and premium product. It certainly is, and it's a certain brand that we're, we're very proud to own, and uh, you know, our customers like it too. Brilliant, thanks Steve. Excellent, thank you. For more videos, products and news, go to mtdcnc.com or follow MTD Online on Twitter.